another day, another hotel, Days in St. Augustine. 70 bucks plus tax, and they're doing some major hotel renovations just down the street. I'll show you a couple things there in a minute. Meantime, it's time for another Philip. A girl! Yeah, she's a guzzler. I don't know how far we've gone. What's the mileage right now? I'll tell you. Maybe you can give me better. 110, 630. 110,000, 630. So I'm guessing we put 1,000 miles on since the last blub, 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 blub of oil. There goes some more Earl. Listen to the Diane Ream show. They're discussing Parkinson's disease. Oh, tremors, rigidity, rigidity, dry eyes. Terrible, 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 terrible. When disease afflicts the human body. My grandmother had Parkinson's. She died in 1972 when I was 12. I remember her trying to cross the street between lights. Could barely get across the street. Sad people get old. Yeah, that's probably a quart right there. One liter, 0.948 liters. So we're going to walk around St. Augustine, historic St. Augustine, Florida. And then we're going to head up 95 and we're going to go to Hilton Head, South Carolina, which is just above Savannah, Georgia, which we went to last year, I guess. We flew to Florida, cheap, then we rented a car, and we dropped it off in Charlotte, North Carolina, with no drop-off fee. I guess people bring their vehicles south, so they were happy to have it north, no charge. Just paid 25 bucks a day, and the oil is a little bit more. A little bit more. Boy, we slept in, didn't wake up till after 8 o'clock. We lazy. Vacations are nice. You just get so out of the routine. You see what I'm doing? Yep. The new cameras have a view, not a viewfinder, but a screen in the front of the camera. Everything. Yeah, this thing's guzzling. I spoke to my buddy who we bought this van for. You know that. I bought it for my neighbor, the one that rescued me from the pit bull that was trying to eat mugs alive. Yep, you never understand what that means to eat somebody or bury somebody alive, but they're still alive. Mugs would have been French toast. I'll let that dribble there for a minute. And I'm going to show you what a fire hydrant looks like when the frost line isn't very low. Acura, no rust. And they allow you to have tinted windows here. Can't have that where I'm from. You can tint your windows black, because the cop cars do it. Here is a fire plug. Borne Fontaine, Mueller Company, Albertville, Alabama. Cast 5 and a quarter 2012 five and a quarter 2012 bury bury that part bury yep there's a bottle of fontaine a fire hydrant there's a lot of water capacity in there i tell you anybody in there and they don't use stainless steel fasteners in Alabama. These aren't very deep where I'm from. They gotta go a meter and a half deep. Hex tubing, three quarter inch, what's going on bro? Hey, just, hello, don't worry about it. I'm not gonna steal these things. Yeah, it's kinda hard to load up three. Uh oh, it's coming to get me. Just admiring. I was just looking at them. They're, they're too heavy to take. Just a little bit. Yep, gotta watch out for your junk. Somebody may try and steal your junk. So that's the score on the fire hydrants. 
where I'm from, they got to be at least four feet, five feet deep, which is a meter and a half to get below the frost line. Interesting. All right, he was dropping off his pecs. I'll go back and put my funnel back with some paper on both ends of it so it doesn't leak oil all over my interior and my clothes. Got some nice houses, nice columns on these craftsman style houses. Well, that's a craftsman, that's not, that's a simpler house. With a huge carport in the back with an apartment upstairs and an old farmhouse, and there's one with some arches, Italian style. Mixed, mixed houses. Um, 50 foot wide, 15 meter, 18 meter wide lots. St. Augustine and Pointe, Ponte Verdra, Ponte Verdra, Vedra, and the beaches. Visitors Convention Bureau on Florida's historic coast, 29 Old Mission Avenue. All right, enough of that. We're done. This thing is done dripping, maybe. We'll crank her up and head off to the beach. Maybe get some new beach shoes or something. <laughs>